you, Denver Venture Realtor. Today we're out here in Aurora, Colorado in the South Shore neighborhood, and we're looking at Homes by Richmond. Four models out here on site to tour. Lots of floor plans to choose from. You got lots of options out here. They got some inventory homes you can build from dirt. Anyway, right now we're taking a look at the Yorktown. So when you first walk in here, uh, you can see right back into your great room there. Um, there's stairs leading upstairs. Stairs leading downstairs, of course, we'll go check up both up and down, but first let's head this way. All right, first thing we come to over here is the coat closet. It will have a door. <laughs> and then it does open up into your main living space here. Um, nice size great room. You can see they put in a fireplace in here. And if you turn right around, it does open up right into your kitchen here. Nice long island. Really love the fact that they're seating on both sides of the island here. Just, I don't know, promotes conversation when you have guests over. Um, dishwasher and sink right in the island. As you can see, a good amount of countertops and cabinets here with your pantry right here in the corner. All right. If we turn around and look this way, you will see your dining room space. Now this is Richmond's sunroom option. So this is an upgrade, um, which gives you this space on this floor and in the basement as well. So um, it is a nice place to spend your money if you are able to, because if not, you're gonna have a wall right here. Um, things will be a little configured a little bit different in here. And you'd kind of like have your kitchen kind of your table space here and then your great room um that's a pretty popular floor plan that you see but that's how it would be set up if you don't do the sunroom all right walking back this way double doors leading into your office window facing the side of the home and i have to say this is a generous size office space yeah bigger than my office at home all right across from that is where you're going to find your powder bath for the main floor. Nice little mudroom space here. Entrance in from your garage. And I do want you to come around and check out the coat closet. I mean, coat closets that aren't typically that interesting. This is a nice sized one. It's actually, you can walk in. Um, so you'll have plenty of room for all your outdoor gear. Okay, that's the main floor. Let's head upstairs. Welcome upstairs. So as you can see, the first thing you come to is your loft space. Um, this is a nice size loft. I have to say there's plenty of room up here. So whatever you need to use it for, it's probably going to work for you. At least have enough room. If you turn around right from where you're at, you're going to see um, the laundry room. Nice to have your laundry room on the second floor. You've got a couple windows in there letting in plenty of light. I don't remember what this is linen closet <laughs> all right if we walk back this way we're going to find our secondary bedrooms and bathrooms let's go this way first secondary bedroom one nice big window looking out towards the front of the home come and walk right around the corner here into our next secondary bedroom about the same size maybe exactly the same size again a nice big window looking out towards the front of the home again these did have the traditional uh, slider closets. Um, bathroom shared between these bedrooms. Nice window in here. And the tub and the um, um, toilet are in their own separate space with a door so that two people can be using the restroom bathroom there. Um, sorry, linen closet. Next secondary bedroom window um, facing the side of the house and this bedroom does have its own bathroom and I do want to apologize I do not remember if that bathroom is an option or not so I will look that up before I post this video and put it in the notes whether that is standard or an option okay walking back out this way across the loft this is nice because your primary bedroom is offset from the secondary bedrooms there coming in as you can see nice big bedroom windows on either side of the bed couple windows here looking out towards the rear of the home and then we come into the um the bathroom here um, let's start on this side a uh, nice big long double sink vanity 
turn around here they are featuring this bathroom with their spa shower option i love it it's huge and you even have like a little um drying off space over here to step up sit down dry off that's nice um you do have other options in this bathroom so if you're a tub person you can do the five piece bath across from that over here is your uh, private toilet closet and at the end of the bathroom you're going to find a really generous sized walk-in closet that does it for the second floor basement is finished let's go check it out welcome to the basement when you first come down the stairs you walk right into your bonus room area as you can see really spacious um and richmond does have the uh, bar option so if you did want a basement bar that's an option you have they don't feature it in the model or anything but um, as you can see plenty of space they threw in the pool table here and then the TV area and then back here where they have this gigantic chessboard set up this is the sunroom this is where the sunroom sits remember upstairs so by getting that option you get this extra space in your basement as well so lots of extra square footage with that option all right they did put in a bedroom down here. Closet. I was, I was shocked there wasn't, weren't shelves. I was thinking linen closet there. And of course, a bathroom. Again, my name's Courtney Murphy, Denver Metro Realtor. We're out here in Aurora, Colorado, in the South Shore neighborhood, looking at homes by Richmond American Homes. If you'd like to see these homes in person, give me a call. I'd love to meet you out here, see if these are the right homes for you. If not, help you find that perfect home. Also, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you don't miss out on any of my home tours. Thanks for joining me today, and have a beautiful day.